Hello, I hope you're having a good day. I'm T.R. Rose of Meow About Cosplay. Welcome to the first episode of my Null Plush Along. So when I was putting together my Plush Making 101 panel, I came across this little guy in storage. This is Null from Lunar. He's a little kitty cat dragon guy. This is one of the first plushies I ever made back in about 2009. And looking at him, I think he could use a glow up. I had sewn cosplays, but I hadn't really sewn plush. So he's made with cheap faux fur, he's got actual feather wings, layered felt eyes, which they have their drawbacks. And he really is in need of a remake. So what my plan is, is to use the excellent teacup lion pattern that I used to make Flareon here and refit it so it looks a bit more like Null. Now I've done something similar when I made Leafeon. You can see that the feet are completely different. There's different ears, there's a different tail, there's extra accessories. And I'm hoping to use those kind of techniques to turn Null into a plushie like this. Now, I don't have a whole lot of reference art of Null. I have this wonderful Japanese art book that shows what he looks like. And I have a picture I found online from a different art book that I do not own that I'm going to use for images for him from the side and from the back. So my plan is to start with this pattern. You can see it's very cute, it's very chibi. And I started by tracing it out and making some modifications. So first off, I added two inches to the width of the body to give him a longer body than the more chibi Flareon here. So I mirrored that here for the belly piece. As you can see, he's got kind of a puff here so I made this belly piece come out here a little bit wider and rounded. Not really sure how it's gonna work for the tail here because on the Flareon, that part goes up to make the back of the haunches. But for Null, he's got a long dragon tail. So I extended the pattern down here and I'm going to have this part come up here underneath to make the tail wider. We'll see how that works. As far as the little black feet, I traced out the pattern pieces that I had already done for Leafeon's feet, but I made them a little bit taller and I brought this up just a little bit because his feet have a dark part that comes up a bit higher than on Leafeon. So this is my plan of attack. These are my rough sketches for pattern pieces. And I hope you'll follow me along on this plush making journey as I attempt to remake Null. <laughs> 